Hey there, and welcome back to our channel. This video will be a bit different to what we usually see, but lately, a lot of people have been asked about Glide and how it compares to Softer. Now, Glide and Softer are both great tools, but they do have their differences. For those that don't know, Glide is a no-code app builder, and it is also based on databases and spreadsheets, similar to Softer. When it comes to the ease of use between these two platforms, so you know, we actually have a full breakdown that I think you should check out on our website. If you go to softer.io slash softer versus glide, the link will also be in the description. You can check out what the differences between these two are in complete detail as well. So getting things started with ease of use, they both offer several templates and have free plans. So that is easy to get started. Uh, when it comes to softer, we have a myriad of different templates that you can check out at softer.io slash templates. And we consistently update these and create new ones over time. According to the feedback that we have received from our users, they find that Softer has a bit more of a flexible yet simpler design experience. Softer has pre-built and functional blocks like forms, calendars, chart blocks, and even organizational chart blocks to have a great head start when building your app. Our templates come with a lot of these automatically inputted and we absolutely love the way that you can interact with your backend data utilizing Softer's simple app builder. The templates really show the styling at a granular level as a lot of these templates do take into account all the very small details you can add to the adjustments regarding the styles. As you can see right here, there are additional styling that can be added to pretty much anything inside of Softer, which makes for the entire experience a lot better and a lot more customizable. Glide offers a few simple layouts to view and interact with the data that are more complex, but much less customizable than what you have in Softer. With Glide, you can have more of a dashboard look and put blocks next to each other, but it works great for internal tools and portals as well. The dashboard look and feel is coming soon in Softer in Q1 of 2024, and we are going to make updates there as well. Softer has some nice one-step action buttons that we have actually made a video on if you want to check that out. But Glide does offer great workflows that can add a layer of functionality to its apps. In both cases, your designs are responsive for web, tablet, and mobile, which are very useful. And you can improve your experience of Glide and Soft using Zapier and Make to create integrations with other apps that you use. Software also offers native Stripe payments, as well as Google Analytics and Hotjar. We've made videos on a lot of these, but you can essentially go to your settings inside of any application and check out the integrations to see more. Glide offers many integrations as well, so both are pretty strong in that department. When it comes to databases, Glide can pull data from Google Sheets, Excel, and Airtable, and even has its own Glide table. While Software is mainly focused on Airtable, Google Sheets, and we also recently implemented a smart suite data source. We have our own API that also allows user management from external systems, which we'll talk about more in the user management section. However, you can connect as many data sources as you need in software. And in Glide, you're actually limited to connecting a single data source. And it is not great in the security aspect because they cache all of the data. On software's end, we don't cache any of the data depending on where it comes from because we work directly with the data. So Softer is great for creating web apps and turning them into a mobile app with literally one click. With Glide, you create mobile first apps for Android or iOS, but you can't have a web app and then switch it to a mobile app or the other way around. You need to create a new app from scratch in that fact. And Glide started with Sheets and mobile, then went to web. When it comes to user management and permissions, Softer has much more advanced user access control to applications and data. We offer granular permissions so that only the users that you want can edit, view, or delete the right information. We've made many videos on this and inside of any pages and even specific blocks, if we go to the visibility tab, you can see I can adjust it based on logged in users as well as the different user groups. And the same thing goes for things like action buttons, item buttons, and we really get granular inside of our user groups and permissions. With these, you can easily define permissions and access levels. This is a huge differentiator as well that really empowers more complex use cases to be built with software. For example, you can have multiple user groups, admin and employee is an example, and what each person can do is much different from a field and record level standpoint. This is not something you can do with Clyde, and we've made many videos on how this can be the case, and we're continuously updating how amazing our user group functionality is to make it easier. Signing in for 
Softer's end is actually more flexible as well. With Softer, you have many authentication options, SSO, Google, or even custom codes. But with Glide, you have a simple email and password and SSO options. So this is a pretty big difference. We want to talk about this explicitly because Softer really allows users to log in in so many different formats. I mean, we're talking email and password, magic link, email with custom code, SSO, domain whitelisting, Google sign in. We have so many options and we've talked about them in other videos that you can check out on this channel. At Softer, we also have a really great community filled with experts and agencies, as well as our own customer support that at this point we believe is ahead of Glide from a community perspective based on the feedback we've received from the no-code community. Softer knows that it is important for every single user to get an answer, so our support team works really hard to make this happen. Apart from our team, Softer has an amazing community and we have these video tutorials to make your journey easier, just like Glide. But one of the main differentiations is a live chat for everyone. As you can see on the bottom right, we have a live chat option that is very useful and allows for quick answers to everyone using our app. And of course, for the paid plans, Softer and Glide offer training and onboarding. So there is really no best no code solution, but you have to find one that meets the requirements for all your needs. And we wanted to go through this in the video and talk about why we believe Softer has a really great platform. And while Glide does things well, we have even more to offer. Like I said, if you wanna check out some of the more like technical specifics, you can go to our comparison page linked down below. Thanks for watching. Check out all the other content on this channel and we'll see you in the next one.